What's up, everybody? I'm Juan. And I'm Jen. And we are Retro and Nerdy. We're just doing a quick intro. Uh, last Saturday, we went to Super Jersey Comic Expo in Homedale, New Jersey, uh, ran by one of our buddies and his friends, uh, Paul. And uh, yeah, we're going to play the video, and then we'll show you guys what we picked up and what we found and our, our thoughts on the show. So yeah, enjoy. I just finished um oh, this Look, one piece. Mm -hmm. Anime sneak peek. That's pretty cool. This one has Naruto and one piece. That's one piece and Euro turns 50. Before. I think this is how they release weekly show me what kind of a these books here. Uh, I'm not too versed in it though. Still pretty cool. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank 
Be fancy. <laughs> Both boxes are half off at this price. I know one says as ticketed, but today. take half off on both. Thank you. Right. If it's not stickered, well, we'll come up with a price. Right. <laughs> there were a few that I just tossed in there that I didn't have a chance to sticker. These are three each, four for ten, including the trades. Okay. <laughs> For Taylor's Start going down that road. Yeah. Let me check out this. I think I saw something. I might have liked this. I need to check comps real quick. <laughs> Let me see the set of three. It's missing, I think, number three. Three, I think it was. They're hard to find. But they're really good. I want one, two, three, four. 75 for one, that's 200. So that's probably bad. Alright. What could you do on this one? Take it all half. Uh, I'd rather get a bundle then. I'll do it, yeah. Thank you so much. No problem. Thank you. It's usually me always walking away with something. She got these for 150. These I was looking for. So. They're hard to find, and they're. I read because I have another set. I read through them. They're. I got the uh, number one. I just had it signed by Bill and submitted at New York Comic Con. So, yeah, this is perfect. Thank you so much. No problem. Thank you. Put in my backpack. Yeah. Or you put in mine. Can you get a little bigger. Mike, you the man. <laughs> Not bad. One fifty. Think about it. Thirty dollars. Oh, what's up, brother? Right. It'll be like ninety. That should be. And how much is number two? Really good. Right. It's like forty fifty. All right. Just 
Yeah, you'll know when it hits your eye, it hits your eye. Like for me, like I was like, I'm trying to stick to game stuff. That's what I like, you know. New York. That I was looking for. But you know, it sometimes a little crazy. Yeah. 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 I have to use your phone. It's not loading. For some reason. If you want to come yeah, fill out, um, the we have a ticket for the yeah. raffle, okay. and then spin the wheel. Oh, sweet. Uh, yeah, I'll do that. All the sperm sure. in the world, Thank you. Okay, the same chance. Will do. I took very good care of the books. What did you get so far? Absolutely nothing. I've just been talking. Want to see why I picked up? Yeah, you actually oh. bought something the first time. We'll swing back. Yeah, it's all like little shops and food places. It's I nice. Come back for some more. Looking at your pricing. Yeah, we will be here. Is that you? Huh? Yeah. 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 <laughs> I'm an artist and a oh, so. I thought you were talking about magic. I was like, I love cards, man. I'll do it. Around, so <laughs> Keep walking around. around. That's not that's exactly what they want. Yeah, that's all yeah. point. That's all point. The whole point is that's why I have to talk. It's under our names. So. We don't do much. We don't do much on our website. We do a media I probably have to get new bags. It, it oh, Dick Tracy. The next place to go. Oh, How dare you? I got you good with the. You moved? Wait, wait. You I'm, I'm saying this in the funniest way. My favorite superhero is that. <laughs> so that's why I said, How dare you? <laughs> but I got that book, so I'm okay. <laughs> but um, what I'm starting to notice is that whatnot is starting to become a little less prevalent. It's still there, and people go crazy with it. No, it's just saturated. I feel like that's a... And, and that's the point. So now, so now people are flocking towards... It, it looks like a, like a poster. Yeah. I'm going. So I'm, I'm a YouTuber, so I'm going to say YouTube, you know... He's got $10,000. Number two, you need this one? Oh, okay. Oh, it kind of looks like a... And I'm like, you and dad's like, uh, short box is good. I like short box. The Hulk. The Hulk. The Hulk. The what? It's <laughs> gone. Shaky the table. Sorry, I appreciate the enthusiasm. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Thank you. The case. Yeah. Oh no. Talking to your wife. <laughs> <laughs> Just catching up. for my run. There you go. And that's it, bro. Just come. Come with no uh, no plan. Yeah. Oh, and Jen, if you want some uh, anime stickers, I want some anime stickers. Ah. Really? <laughs> is it under foreign font? Under what? Oh, this is actual foreign font. Tio Rico. Sounds so weird when you say it in Spanish. Uncle Scrooge is Teo Rico. Yeah. Okay, I'm Yeah. I said, let me buy the bundle because I left it off. Captain N. You know what I'm saying? Oh, look at this, man. Look at your captain, man. This one? Yes, please. 
these for cash. Cash? Yeah. 20 bucks. Sweet. You got it. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Why are they calling me? Yeah. I'm on channel one. Bucks, is that you have a better chance of figuring out the name. Do you need a bag or anything? Or are you guys good? No, perfect. Thank, Thank you. you. Stand, are you going to huh? fill out your wall? That is all in my wall box. Where are we going now? Here? Him and his wife. But this is also, where'd it go? Out of five. So, there's five of the same of this card. Then there's a, a higher up version. Correct. Shop continue. So, we have a whole lot of space. We're looking at this like a set. How are you guys doing? Good, thank you. There's also one of these five. And out of ten, out of fifty. There's one, there's You guys are looking for anything in particular? Oh, shit. Yes, this. <laughs> that, apparently. What is it? Oh, yeah, that's a good one. There's Link. Everything's 10% off, by the way. I'll just say that.
because I think worst case I get that green. But no way. Thank you. Thank you. You too. Is that going on YouTube or yeah. anything? Yeah. Okay. Then in, in that case, give me a close up if you don't mind. Oh. You can keep that. Oh, I will. Thank you. What kind of stuff are you guys looking for today? Uh, right now, just um, she's actually looking for Sailor Moon, but it's been pretty, pretty hard to go finding any. I don't know if I have any Sailor Moon. Are you into like horror and stuff like that? Uh, not yet. Okay. Because I also have another set of magazines down there. Uh, there may be some horror stuff in there. And there's a little bit of horror dispersed Never around. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's fine. I've got another I've got another set of too. So it'll go right in. No? I don't think you're here already? Yep. <laughs> He's awesome. He's moving some man too. This is sick. These guys didn't have them last time, right? Oh, this is... This is where trouble begins, right? I love it because it, her age, this age is so much fun, but like, it's starting to drive me nuts. It's so cute. I always wanted a gray one. They have those, those ones up there too. They don't even have those ones. Baby Shark, Spooky Halloween. Oh, now, right now. I thank God I might have asked this. Baby Shark, Spooky Halloween, right now, right now. I know, I 
I get it. I don't have a muck man. This, this is like a bonanza. Sailor Moon was pretty cool. Where is it? It's back 
How much are you asking for your Sailor Moon print? Oh, thank you. Oh, uh, it's 20 by itself, 35 in the frame. Would you like one? Oh, thank you. 25 by itself, 35 in the frame. It's 20 by itself, 35 <coughs> 20 by in the frame. Sorry. That's some good ones. Would you like one? Thinking about it here. Guess you want to see what else we got going on. Find a spot for it. I mean, it's really nice. Yeah, I got a couple more. Come on, let's see. Give you something like it. You wanted to take a peek through them? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Too much fun. All the, a lot of these start off as sketch covers. Me neither. <laughs> I tried, I tried, I tried. Yo, know, that's a sick ass. It breaks my heart when I come back. It's like a 9 6. Yeah. 9 4. You want to grab it because we get two for 16 in the frame. Do you want that one? Really nice. Sometimes we'll have to go to Walmart. Would that be interesting, Braden? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'll take a look. Oh, you can look through there. Come over on my self published book. That's pretty cool. Most of our. Uh, That's nice. nice. Asking on these? Uh, buck fifty, buck twenty-five. Yeah, all, all the nine eights are a buck fifty, then nine sixty is buck twenty-five, then nine fours are hundred. It just goes down from there depending on grade. Right. Hmm. I feel 
like you really like this one. Yeah, that one is cute. What about this one? This one? Mm -hmm. right, so we're gonna do this one? Or do that one? Yeah. Let me see what else you guys do. Which one? Oh. Yeah, it is. Do you like cages like that? So we're gonna take we'll take the Betty. Oh yeah, that's the new series. Thank you so much. Thank you. Really appreciate it. Good choice. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I have that one. You guys were in New York, right? Yeah. I saw you in New York, right? Yeah, we I, saw, I didn't see you, but I saw you in New York. Yeah. yeah did you see a Wu book? Did you? I saw your Wu Tang clay. Did you see the Wu Tang book they dropped? I did. Yeah. I missed it. I missed, dude. I missed everything so bad. Let me see it. It's, it's, it's an art book, but bro, they crushed it on that. Oh, they did. Yeah. That's they, really nice. Who was selling that? It was some booth in the 4,000s. <laughs> but he dropped that. He dropped that. No. And way. he dropped an Ultimate Warrior one. That was fire. Jesus. Right. And they, they limited them to 125 copies. And yeah, then he had the gold ones for 50 copies. They were nice. I should have bought the gold and I, I cheat me. I, I, you, know, you know, you're like, oh, I'm going to save a little bit here. Yeah, cheat me. Yeah. Should have took it. I've been know? there, man. Trust me. All right. You're a video, you're a video game guy, Yeah, right? I'm, a, I'm a video game You ever see that? What's, what's that? Let me see. It's a pricey book, though. When I got wiggle room on that, but that's... Holy shoot. I know, I know what this one is. That's the book, right? Yeah. Let me get this on video, because I'm like... Oh, you, don't but, see it, you don't see it out too often. That's insane. Right. Let me put this back before I get myself in bigger trouble. <laughs> um, yeah. E, what can you do on both of these? I'm, I'll pay cash. I'll take it off your hands. Hold this, baby. Nice. Oh. Uh, I got a little wiggle room on this. I could probably knock off 25 on this one. Okay. okay. So we can do 275. Um, and we'll knock off 25 again. So we'll do um, 275. 350? Mm -hmm. 350. Sounds good. Castlevania 1 and Sega. Okay. 20, and I do have 10. Oh, you are, man. Yeah, dude, I try I to, like that. Yep. I try to get break down. She's like, why do you get so much change? I'm like, because sometimes they don't have it or it just helps them out. All right, let's count that. Make sure okay. my mathematics is decent. <laughs> my man, thank, thank you, you so much. I appreciate that. Thank, thank you. you. It's nice thank seeing you guys again. Good to see you. Thank you. All right. High grade. Uh, Sailor Moon and I picked up Castle wow. number one. Yeah, that's awesome. Because her one is beat up, but now how much is it for that? Dude, that's sick. Like, uh, 
That's really good. That's really good. Oh, look who it is. Trouble. I gotta watch what I do. What's up? What's up? Getting in trouble, you? Yes. <laughs> Always. Yeah, we have to just pick up some stuff. What'd you get? What'd you get? Oh, did you, did you get what I think you got? I knew it. I knew it. As soon as I saw that, I was like, she's going to buy it. We were I know telling she is. Because they sent her her number one in yeah. like a regular bag. No bag for the nada. Yeah, it had nothing in it. So I said, screw it. Let's upgrade your copy. Wait, you're going to get a kick out of this. Guess what I saw yesterday at Menlo Park? The glitter one. No way. At True Believers, $400. I was like, it's on eBay for $350. I'm going to find, I'm going to leave. I think someone on Woodland's going to make the three. So I'm like, you know what? I'll pay the eBay fee and buy it for $350. Just get. The box is a little, like, it has little dents in it, but like, I don't care. I just want it. Right. For $350, i will buy it. Yeah. Jesus. But if you have Woodland, they have it on Woodland. I do have whatnot. I'm morally against it, but I have an account anyway. Yeah, sometimes sometimes you can get a good deal, but sometimes yeah. it's like... I would check there. I know. I like I'll check there. But I was like, oh, I, I was like, I hope I saw it. I was like, I got to tell you, it's here. But <laughs> not for $400. <laughs> <laughs> Especially when the PPG is only at 350 Right. Yeah, no, no. Mm. Yeah. So mad. I was like... Can't buy this. Yeah, right. Can't buy this. Sometimes they overcharge. Oh, they overcharge yeah. everything. Like, I don't. I go in the store, but I make it a habit not to buy anything because I'm like, dude, you are expensive. They're very yeah. pricey, right? <laughs> like, I know you got it, but goddamn. <laughs> 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 Keep on. All right, we'll swing by again, my peoples. Look at this, our horn gym, bro. Take the whole lot. I took them all, so I gotta get more. You know how to do it. Yeah, I was like, I don't know. I was like, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, everybody wants toxic events. Two times my wife goes, I don't know what she does. Oh, she's on there. She'll find us. I love those little Tiger Little watches. They're shit. They're shit. Oh, yeah, they're so cool. <laughs> they're crap, but they're so good. Can that go in your comic room? That's awesome. I have so I have that I have zero. That's funny. <laughs> I know. No! I'm sorry. Are you good? 
have more stuff down there too. I'll get in there for sure. Can I get my beans on? Dude, did I tell you what happened? How I set my book uh, overnight. 45. 45. Oh, I was, yeah, I was going to ask It you finally got there yesterday and it's signed for. And I'm just like, I'm going to go to the post office on Monday and be like, you guys owe me money because I paid for next day. And really, what you gave me was priority. I have more Black Series. Like, I got a spike. I'm going to get my money back. Pissing me off. Pissing me off. Well, I mean, pay for something. Well, that's the thing. They said that they give you a money back guarantee. If it doesn't arrive, they got to ship overnight. Um, like better, uh, Express, US, USPS Express. Huh? That's on the phone. Like, yo, it's my dope. Yeah. I did miss him. How much are you have on these? 20, that one's 20, these are 30, the ones in the back. Those are the, the deluxe figures in the back. That's by Mattel back in like 2006. Yeah. Should I? I'm gonna look at the rest. Can you show me the rest of them? Might as well. All right, guys. So that was it. That's the video. <laughs> uh, so we'll get to what we picked up. I'll start first. And uh, by all means, as you saw the video, there was a lot of vendors, a lot of people we knew from the community. And overall, we had such a great time at the show. We didn't stay long because we were able just to pick up a ton of the stuff that we found. I don't know what Jen's doing, but uh, so just some of the stuff that I picked There's up. There's a hair in my mic. Sorry. It was, just, it was entering my mouth. Yeah. Well, that's yeah, it's terrible. Uh, Ghostbusters number two. And uh, this is like dollar, two dollar bins. This is Ghostbusters number 21. Again, two dollar book. Over there, I found a Captain N, the Game Master number three. Uh, I already have one and two. So now I have number three. Uh, picked up, picked this up from my buddy Erod. Uh, this is Castlevania, the Belmont Legacy number one. And really, really great condition Ooh. and then that one vendor who was selling the resident evil magazines uh he had one two and four missing number three 
Uh, but yeah, this is basically a Jim Lee cover. It's fantastic. I'm hoping he does a CGC signing. I will send this in. Get that signed. That's number one. This is number two. I got to get a better bag and board for this for sure. And this is number what, four. And this was sold as a bundle, as you saw in the video. And then just some books that I picked up today. Uh, Invincible number 44. And Invincible number numero ocho. And also I picked up from Action Figures Galore. You saw their table. It's incredible. Uh, this Unpunched Muck Man. And Joe Eyeball. Again, Unpunch. Uh, as you can see, we changed. We kind of changed everything around here. Uh, we're still working. It's a work in progress. So excuse any of the looks. Uh, we're still working on it. But yeah, that's what I picked up. Jen, take it away. Um, so I can't remember exactly what I picked up. So I know there's two things that I did uh, pick. Well, actually, one picked up for me. Um, there was an artist that we came across. I know you heard that. Sorry. Um, there was an artist that we came across at a table. Um, Juan, I'm sure, is going to put the name. It's also on the and on here too. Um, this is a Betty Page number one. It, this is in um, like a basically like a commission, yeah. where she's dressed as Spider Gwen, mm -hmm. but it's also a homage cover. No, it's this like is a, a homage. It's homage, homage. Yeah, I, I said homage. <laughs> it's a homage. Yeah, homage. Um, there we go. So it's signed and sketched by Brian Lacey. Yep, that was the gentleman. He had a few of these there. They were fantastic. He had a bunch of commissions that were graded at his table, but this one. This one eye. was stellar. Yeah, this one was probably the best one. And then um, I got the uh, one actually picked up for me, the first uh, print of Sailor Moon number one. And this was from Erod again at a 9.6. Uh, there's only a few of these on the census. Really high grade. Very happy uh, for Jen to finally own this one. As she had a number one, I think it was a second print. I have number one. It's a second print, and it's very rough. It's in it's, rough I want to say a fine condition because yeah. I bought it on Macari a while ago, yeah. and the seller actually mailed it um, in just a regular envelope. Yeah, there was no real protection on it, so it kind of it was it was not great. No, like I I have it in my collection to you know to complete the run You're right but yeah all right really and have. then you, you we didn't get you any separate books no you sure nope you only got these two books you didn't get no other books no i feel like you i feel like you did i don't remember but i don't think you it's not check your little maybe comic book binder let me see Stay tuned. Hello. Oh, yeah, we did. Sorry. Yeah, you did, see? So this is Sentai number four. And we found number one. I found this number is the one, one that you found. Right? right. The day before the show at a shop uh, near me, near us, JC Comics. Yeah, that too. Yep. No, that I found in um, New York Comic Con. This one? Yeah. Oh, well, you might as well show it. So here's the deal with New York Comic Con. Uh, we didn't have a great time. We had a great time seeing our friends, but we didn't have a great time at the show. We picked up just a few things at the show, and that's going to be a whole separate video. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much that's pretty much it. Yeah. Um, New Jersey Comic Expo uh, for they had a lot of things going on, and they had to make a lot of changes in the midst of these things that went on. It felt like nothing was going their way, uh, but overall, they had over three thousand people show up to a free show and it was a great time we had a great time uh paul and the guys they they threw an incredible show they had some great guests there and um you know i was talking to some friends and uh had a buddy that went to Rhode Island comic con and he said that there was absolutely no comics there not even maybe one or two booths he was saying a couple of booths but nothing like that he said it's a shame that it's called the Comic Con. Mm. And um, you're seeing this more and more at conventions where, like, these Comic Cons are are more like a pop pop, uh, pop culture cons. They have great guests, don't get me wrong, uh, but 
even New York felt like they had a lack of comic books this year. There was a lot of variants, uh, but it was missing a lot of the comics. Um, it's a lot more anime. It was a lot culture. of there was a lot of anime, yeah. Um, you know, thankfully though, there's these shows like Super Jersey Comic Expo, uh, King Kong show here in Jersey as well. Terrific Con, Baltimore Comic Con that uh, they stay grounded when it comes to comic books, mm -hmm. right? You could go there and you could dig for a long time and, and, you know, these shows are great. So, you know, it's really sad that a lot of these bigger shows, I feel like are kind of, I don't know, like moving, moving comics. Away from a comics. Bit. Yeah, moving a little bit away from mm -hmm. comics. And uh, yeah, it's truly a shame. It's truly a shame. Uh, but overall, it was a great show. Make sure you follow those guys, Super Jersey Comic Expo. They're on Instagram, Facebook. They'll update you. Paul kind of told us the story of what happened, but we'll have we'll let them share that story. It's messed up, but above everything else, they kind of risen to the occasion, mm -hmm. and they were able to get the show done and pull it off. So, but yeah, it was uh, you know, it, I, you could tell they were very stressed out leading up to the show, and uh, you know, you guys, if you're watching this video, you did such a great job. Be very proud of yourselves. Uh, this is a show for the comic book community, much like King Kong show. Again, another show that's very much based on the comic book community. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What? How do you like the show? Um, it was I, I like the fact that I mean, it was kind of sad with what happened and how things had to kind of change really fast. Right. Um, they had issues with the banners that ended <laughs> up coming in like really small. But, you know, overall, the show was great. I think they did a great job. Um, anytime we see Paul, it's always, um, it's always a lot of like good atmosphere, good vibes because he just, he's very welcoming when you walk in. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the vendors were all great. Yep. So I'm, I would have to say it was a great show. Yeah. So, and this is, this is going to be a long video. Here's the thing with our channel. When we go places, we want to take you through the whole event. We want to take you through the vendors, through the people and make it feel like you're there. So that way you can get a feel of what it is to like go to these shows. Mm -hmm. uh, New York Comic Con was very difficult to film. Uh, the amount of people, and I'll be open, I have tons of anxiety. So to be in that atmosphere was a very overwhelming. Man, um, you couldn't even get through the aisles. Yeah, like I, 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 I get the uh, the appeal. Yeah, uh, because there's a lot of great vendors. There's a lot of great things to see, but at the same time. When I can't even get to an area because it's really crowded, it just sucks. It's very, very difficult. We we didn't even finish looking through half the uh, the convention because we were either tired or just too too much. It was a it was a taxing day, but we had fun because we got to see our friends. We got to hang out, mm -hmm. uh, have some laughs, get some good food, and um, overall, being with our friends was great. Being at New York Comic Con was very hard. And then you guys heard there was a pooping incident. Uh, at New York Comic Con, and yeah, it just seemed like uh, so again. I I get the whole like maybe the person was waiting in line and he couldn't hold it, but, <laughs> but I'm like I just right there. Um, I, I I can't. Yeah, it's gross. Um, but you know, like I said, it was very packed. A lot of guests, a lot of people, a lot of artists. Artist Alley was booming, so good for those guys. Mm -hmm. uh, Jen picked up an excellent commission. But again, when we go a little more in depth into New York Comic Con. That was the one good thing um, that came out of it. Yeah. And Kevin Eastman. Yeah, okay, maybe Kevin Eastman. But we'll go into depth of that probably next week. We'll make a video talking just about New York Comic Con and uh, showing the footage that we actually got to man manage to get. But, yeah, so if next year Super Jersey Comic Expo comes back, I encourage everyone to go. It's one of the best one-day Comic Cons, Comic Cons in New Jersey. Uh, King Kong show is another excellent show. And then Jersey, we have comic book, like, comic book shows. So it's just a more s smaller. It takes place in, like, churches and um, well, it takes place in, like, smaller, real small venues with a couple of, of uh, vendors. And, uh, yeah, so, again, it's a, it's a 10 out of 10 for me. And, uh, you know, we were there about four hours digging and looking through stuff. And yeah, we loved it. We loved it. We love you, Paul. Thank you for, again for having us. And uh, you know, make sure you follow us on our Instagram, 
If you haven't, make sure to subscribe to our channel, uh, Retro and Nerdy. And yeah, I think that's all I got. You good? Yep. You good? That's it. All right, guys. Sorry again for a little delays in, in, in um, getting these out there. Um, we have so much going on. We're going to Disney at the end of next month. We have yeah. that going on, you know, and uh, my schedule's changing. Jen's It'll schedule's change. changed. You know, I'm, it's a little I'm busy harder. With, with my stuff and taking care of myself. So it's been a bit rough, but I'm glad we were able to get one of these videos out. Continue to subscribe. Check out our old videos. Uh, there is a card show at the end of November. It's supposed to be pretty big. We'll probably go and get some footage of that and uh, post that here. Uh, next week, we'll do a New York Comic Con wrap, wrap of video. I know it's like three weeks out, but it is. But yeah, with that said, I'm Juan. I'm Jen. We are Retro Nerd. Thank you so much. Check you out next time. Bye. Peace.